Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best hitch rack. Starting at number 5. Rocky Mounts Backstage. If you enjoy traveling or have joined the van life trend to explore the world with your bike, you may face some challenges when transporting your bikes. Luckily, Rocky Mounts has designed the backstage platform hitch rack to cater to the specific needs of modern camper vans or anyone who requires easier access to the rear of their vehicle. Unlike other hitch-mounted racks we tested, which interfere with using a van's rear doors, even when tilted down, the backstage boasts an impressive tilt mechanism at the rear of the rack. However, the most remarkable feature is the arm that pivots out and away from the rear doors moving both the bikes and the rack clear of the doors range. The rack is incredibly versatile with a weight limit of 60 pounds per bike and will cradles that fit a wide range of bikes and tires up to 5 inches wide. The backstage is a convenient choice for people who need to easily access the back of their vehicle, even though it has some minor issues. Bikes with wide handlebars may have limited clearance on the tray, so they must go on the outer tray. Additionally, the rack is quite heavy and bulky, making it hard to maneuver. Nevertheless, compared to other brands that charge extra for swing-away accessories, the backstage is a great value. Coming at number 4. Yakima Stage 2. The Yakima Stage 2 is a fantastic hitch mount tray rack that can hold up to 70 pounds per bike tray. It is highly versatile and can fit different wheel sizes, wheelbase lengths, and tire widths, making it an excellent choice for almost any bike type and size. The rack is easy to load, thanks to the sturdy front wheel clamp and a ratchet strap for the back wheel. It also has a remote tilt release handle that makes folding it up and down effortless. If you own a heavy electric bike, you can purchase an aftermarket ramp-up loading ramp for around $100, which makes it easy to roll bikes onto the trays without lifting them. To prevent handlebar contact, the staggered bike trays can be offset. The Stage 2 is easy to install and remove, thanks to a speed knob that tightens an anti-wobble cam for stability and locks the rack to the vehicle. The clamp arms have integrated cable locks to secure the bikes to the rack, and there's also a welded lock loop for attaching an additional lock. You can get the Stage 2 in 1.25-inch and 2-inch receiver sizes and two color options, 2-inch only. You can also add a 2-bike add-on to carry up to 4 bikes, 2-inch only. The Stage 2 is a sturdy hitch rack that can withstand wear and tear. However, it is quite heavy, weighing in at 63.5 pounds, which makes it challenging to move around when not mounted on a vehicle. Additionally, it is a large rack that requires significant storage space. While most users will find the 70-pound weight limit sufficient, Yakima imposes lower limits of 60 and 42 pounds per bike for RV and off-road use. At number 3. Rocky Mounts Monorail. Some hitch racks are more affordable, but the Rocky Mounts Monorail offers great value for its price. It is less expensive than the most expensive hitch racks, but has comparable features and performance. The monorail supports the bike by the wheels without touching the frame, a common feature of good platform racks. It is versatile, with well-designed wheel trays and ladder strap extenders equipped to handle everything from slim road tires to 5-inch fat bike treads. Testers found this rack user-friendly, with a one-hand tilt release mechanism at the end of the main support arm that works with loaded bikes. It has a long new style cable lock and a hitch pin lock that secures rack and bikes. The monorail is a well-built bike rack that has a robust receiver arm, main support spine, and wheel trays. However, it also has some plastic components, like the folding front wheel and pivoting rear wheel trays, which might not be durable in the long run. The rack is attached to the vehicle's receiver using a standard threaded hitch pin, which may not be as easy to use as other brands' tool-free tightening and locking mechanisms. Despite these drawbacks, the monorail is a great buy that provides excellent performance and versatility at an affordable price. The Quat Sherpa 2.0 is a little more expensive but also an excellent rack to consider. Number 2 of my list.
Quat Piston Pro X. Quat went all out in building the Piston Pro X, and it's brilliant. While very expensive, you get a high-performance rack with features and technology that no other racks currently have. This tire hold rack clamps the bike securely by the tires with no frame or rim contact with user-friendly piston-actuated ratcheting tire arms. Utilizing the clever fast-fit wheel chalk system, you can quickly load bikes with 18-inch to 29 wheels. The 67 pounds per bike weight limit means it can carry almost any e-bike on the market. Slick security features like a locking stainless steel hitch pin, integrated locking tool storage, and a flexible 12mm cable lock help keep the rack and bike safe. Integrated LED lights help keep you safe by putting your brake lights on the back of the rack instead of being obscured by the bikes you're hauling. Durable powder coating, 99% metal construction, and Kashima coated stanchions strive to make this rack pass the test of time. The Piston Pro X is not only expensive, but it is also quite large and hefty, making it difficult to move or store. Nonetheless, this is the absolute best hitch rack money can buy. This rack's safety, security, and features may make it worth the cost. Ensure you have the required 4-pin electrical connector to use the integrated brake lights, or you'll need to purchase an adapter. And number 1. Thule T2 Pro XTR. The Thule T2 Pro XTR is our top pick for a hitch-mounted bike rack and it's evolved to be better than ever. This rack has consistently ranked highest among competitors due to its ease of use and versatility. It can safely transport your bikes, from featherweight carbon fiber road bikes to heavy electric mountain bikes. Thule has paid attention to details, making features such as the approachable loading height and quick lock will clamps that close with one hand. The wheel trays are wide and accommodate tires and wheels of all sizes, including fat bikes. Thule has made accessing the rear of your vehicle even easier by relocating the tilt release mechanism to the end of the main support arm. We highly recommend adding the two bike add-on to the T2 Pro, as it is the ideal option for transporting up to four bikes. The T2 Pro XTR isn't cheap, it's also large and heavy, with a large storage footprint. We've previously tested the T2 Pro XT version, the T2 Pro XTR is the updated model, which is nearly identical except for two small wheels that aid in moving the rack around to store. This is one of the best hitch mount racks you can buy. The rack's performance and user-friendliness make it feel like a great value. Check out this video description for latest price and more information. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.